and um i remember my homie uh bobby ramos swifty ak swifty was telling me like joe I, I don't understand why you're winding down here bro like yeah why are you doing what you're doing i'm like what do you mean and he's like yeah you got both parents and i was like eh? what does that mean he's like dude like look around and i started looking at all the homies i'm like wow everyone either had was had just a mama yeah or was right. grandparents or something and i started sitting there and i was like man you know i wasn't raised in church yeah at all we didn't okay. go on holidays we didn't go on any any events I, yeah. I i associated church with funerals and weddings okay okay and uh the closest thing that i had was grandparents in new mexico who were like me oh you're not living right yeah you know you were raised catholic and i'm like i was raised catholic i don't even remember that you know yeah. whatever but i had the statues and the, and the necklaces whatever so I, I'm trying to say that I had no knowledge of what it meant to be God. So when my buddy said that, I'm sitting there and I'm thinking, well, shoot, what is wrong with me? Yeah. But then I started, I started knowing, well, I came from some chaos in the home. Uh -huh. And then and then it's the homies in the front. And at a young age, I desired yeah, right. what they represented. Yeah. You know, when we had sports, we were in sports all life. We yeah. were in baseball, boxing, football, basketball, soccer. We played everything. So my, so the, who came to see us? The neighborhood homies. Yeah, and they, the homies would come 15, 10 deep, and I would see the other teams, and even people of my team would look like, "Oh, dang!" Yeah, right. Like, uh -huh. Wow, and I started yeah. seeing that respect. I started seeing that whole change the whole course of the game. Yeah. So I was kind of sitting there like, 